Good morning. It's Tuesday, uh, May 26th. Uh, I'm out doing some exercises. Uh, I wanted to show you what's involved in doing my <laughs> inversion <laughs> upside down. You see my ladder over here. I get a towel out uh, to protect my knees uh, as I hang upside down. And then I climb up there. I use these extra bars to hold my feet uh, so I don't fall over. If I can't pull myself up with a setup, I can easily I can just slip my feet out and and do a backwards flip and climb out. But so I'm, that's my safety valve. <laughs> but I've always been able to do the sit-ups, at least a few of them, upside down. And then the hanging upside down uh, just for a few minutes like that uh, helps stretch out your spine uh, with your body weight, uh, and then I, all of your blood rushes to your head, and so you look kind of funny and. <laughs> It's kind of interesting. Let's try it here. Got my feet in place. Now I'm going to go upside down. Here we go. Oh, I forgot to tell you, <laughs> I need to clear my pockets and, and think everything else is going to fall out <laughs> coming down. You notice my shirt falls down over my head too, usually. <laughs> I should have gone one rung higher. <laughs> my head's kind of hitting the ground, <laughs> but it's kind of fun. Let me see if I can stretch out just a little bit. <laughs> Woo! <sighs> I saw that uh, Justin Varengia, the master of uh, meditation, and yoga uh, sometimes does some upside down uh, yoga positions for his uh, uh, meditation so I thought some, sometime I may try that but not, not this way I need to do a little bit different <laughs> oh. let's pull back up there we go Let's do a couple more sit-ups. We can. There we go. Whew. Have a great day. It's going to be fun. <laughs>